Welcome back. We are getting a glimpse into the desperation faced by Cubans every day, thanks to a video posted by a frustrated mother that has gone viral. So many people have seen and shared her post that even the Cuban government has taken notice. Local 10's Hatzel Vela is live to explain the state's reaction. Hatzel. Nicole, the video was posted just four days ago, and already it's been shared close to 15,000 times. If you talk to folks on the island, they'll tell you it's because people can understand and connect to what she's saying. This is new video from CNN as she shows up to a meeting with the Cuban government. Frustration over lack of food and basic necessities from a Cuban mother who took to Facebook to post this video that has gone viral. Amelia Calzadilla, the mother of three, urges other Cuban mothers to speak up, wondering how much more they can take. Her complaint about her exorbitant power bill turned into a laundry list of grievances against the government. On Wednesday, she says, power outages keep her daughters from going to school because she cannot cook for them. We want to live in dignity, she says, adds Cubans should not have to rely on family living abroad to survive. And tells us she doesn't fear being arrested for simply speaking out. We reached out to other Cubans on the island. Known government critics who say this was a genuine expression of frustration many are feeling on the island. She's merely a symptom of the worsening situation in a disastrous regime. Earlier today, after meeting with government officials, Calzadilla talks to foreign press, says she first wants to get home to her kids. But she has vowed to go back on social media and talk about that meeting that she had with the government. By the way, no surprise here, folks on the island tell us that the government is already using its state-run media to try and discredit her. But our reporting live in the newsroom, I'm Hatsa Local 10 News. A lot of people probably want to hear that update. Thank you, Hatsal. For much more on this story, go to local10.com. And for coverage in Spanish, local10.com and Español, log on to local10.com forward slash Español.